are. Streetwise is next today. Can we magic up the magician's bicycle? Oh. That's Lisa, there we are. Magic! <laughs> oh, no, <laughs> no, 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 This one comes from Belinda Holdsworth, who is from Ringwood in Hampshire. What are you doing with that card? Magic card it's a, a bike for a magician. It's got the playing card wheels there and the top hat. Wonderful, isn't it? Brilliant. Brilliant. It's and very streetwise. streetwise for this week. I saw it, I'm telling you. You mean magic? Streetwise couriers, how can I help you? 3737. Three, yeah, bring your job sheet back, Ange. I'll do your waiting time, but tell them if you won't sign, they can't have the package. I can't bear rats. About a 50 minute wait at the moment, okay? There isn't any rat. <laughs> well, it must be a very serious mouse, that's all I can say. Like those flowers. Rats are dangerous. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, I've had a call from the Danish bank in Hope Street. They want a rider to do him as directed. What's going on? It's just one of those things. I can't stand rats. Rats? It's like a phobia. I can't help it. What rats? Where? There is no rat. He's seeing things. Streetwise, can I help you? Won't blowing it up make it bigger? Just get on with your work, Bob. Yes, George. Of course, it might not be a rat. Could have been a very big spider. What? Ignore him. I'm afraid it'll be about 15 minutes. Is that OK? Here, do this one. What we need is a torch. Probably resting. Perhaps you should leave it. 4747 to base. <coughs> Stand by, troop. Be with you in a second. Can you see it, Sean? I felt it. Something ran over my head. See? I told you. I'll um, phone the council. Don't forget that as directed. I'll be in the office. Come on, control. Unit needing a directive out here. I'll get back to you, troop. I've got a crisis. Yeah, so what else is new? Suit yourself, phone clue. And what time have you booked it for? Yeah. Die, phone clue! Four seven four seven. Speak to me. Where are you, four seven? Just been totaled by a female phone clone. Say again, Trip. You'll be on a car phone. Sick of them, I am. Any damage, four seven? Damage report in progress. Control. Take it easy, four seven. You still here? Shell, remember when George calls in? No cash jobs. You said. Right. One, 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 one. Have you picked up from the smoke and the bows yet? Roger, Roger. B&B, Clark Over. Well, don't hang about, Billy. He said it was urgent. Now we think we've got a rat. A rat? I touched it. It was horrible. There's so much junk under there, it's a public health hazard. Hunch, you fancy an ass directed? Keep you out of mischief for the day. They can close this place down. Yeah, all right. Where is it? Danish Bank. Get the details off an old docket. You know, I couldn't get anyone from the council to come here till the end of the week. We could be infested by then. Can you keep your feet up till Friday, Shell? This Danish Bank job won't go on long, will it? Shouldn't think so. Is there a problem? Bob, you know very well. We've got a date, haven't we? Have we? Bob? Oh, yeah, right. To talk about Dave, you mean? See you at my place, then. Don't be late, yeah. OK? Couldn't George have done the as directed? Not a good idea. You'd have to be a bit careful what you give, George. See. Looks a bit like favouritism to me, wouldn't you say, Shell? Fancy cup of tea. Some. 
What's the story, me little bog-trotting friend? Phone clones get you an all, did they? What? Yuppies. They are from the planet Tharg and not to be trusted. Runaway trip. I've got enough problems. Sounds expensive. What do you think it is? Doesn't really matter, does it? It's knackered whatever it is. I think I'll have to pay for it. Definitely. No question. But I'm already paying for my bike. Ooh, life's a bitch and then you die. Why don't you call control and go directive? No way. I'm not telling Bob. Well, I'll just deliver it. By the time they find out, I'll be long gone. Not very bright. Your name's on the docket. Well, maybe they'll think it was damaged after the delivery. You don't fancy going to smell them boys, do you? What, you mean like in a tactical support role, you mean? Yeah, something like that. Negative 1-1. One, one. I've got my own mission. I seek the phone clone eliminator, a device to rid the world of the alien scum. Anyway, I've got to go around Dave's in a bit. Great. Thanks. Pleasure. Try standing again. Okay. Now try spreading the weight through onto the other leg. You sure they took the right measurements? You've probably been overdoing it on the exercise, David. What, I'm supposed to be sitting around all day, am I? Well, that seems to be level. You certain there isn't a robot going to be asking for this back? You'll get used to it. It takes time, that's all. Yeah, sure. What made you think you could get away with it? Come on, I'm waiting. I thought you were going to take it out of my wages. And what do you think I'm going to do now? It was a videotape, not an original, a copy. If you'd have called in at the time, you could have gone back and got another one. Now, what you've lost the client is time. Time is what we sell people. That's why they use us. Except in the case of smelting and bones, they probably won't in future. Am I getting through to you at all? Excuse me. I'm sorry, to just find... a second. Where are you going? Pardon, no, you're not. Rack your bike. You're staying in the office. Hello. Do it, Billy. Yes, sir. I'm sorry, what was that? Yeah, I'm trying to find Dave Jackson. He does work here, yeah? Dave? You're looking for Dave? <laughs> That's right. I'm Eve. You must be Bob. Yeah. Move your left foot forward. Transfer your weight onto it. That's what they'll tell you at the walking school. That's it. Keep your hips level. Yeah, he's through. Good. Great. A few more adjustments, a bit more practice. We'll be able to take it home. <laughs> I'd rather take you. I don't think my boyfriend would like that. Oh. Hey, let's give you a rest. So don't bring him. See you, Eric. Okay, alien school. Met my day. Thanks. Never ever do cats in Torquay. <laughs> oh, you're a dancer, right? That's right. Look, think of it is. Dave's taken some time off. Have you tried ringing him at home? There's no reply. Oh, that's funny, isn't it, Chill? Look, why don't you leave your number where we can contact you? And if Dave calls in, we'll tell him you were asking. Isn't that right, Chell? Do you think he will call in? Hard to say, dear. All the riders are casual. They come and go, don't they, Bob? Yeah. Ah! It's there again. Something's touching my foot. Keep perfectly still, Shell. Don't make it feel as if it's threatened. Don't. It's a rat. Oh, it's a cat. Oh, it's a kitten. <laughs> oh. 
No more will the alien fiends stalk the streets of planet Earth. Eat lead, foe clone! She's right. Dave's not answering the phone. I better get over there, drop in a note about this Eve girl. You manage all right till I get back. How long are you going to be? Not long. Shouldn't be too busy now. Streetwise couriers, can I help you? And if I'm not back, make sure George doesn't get any cash jobs. Go. Go into EC3 on the account. Yes, got that. Yes. I'll sell it to you for us. Oh, call this one while I get the phone. Oh, no, Ray, I can't call jobs. Of course you can. You've been on the receiving end often enough. Streetwise Couriers, can I help you? <laughs> yep. Anyone free or coming free for St. Martin's Lane at all? It's Billy. Yes, Billy, 1-1. One, one. Who are you? Right, 210, if you must know, I'm working in the office, because earlier on... Just a minute, what's that got to do with it? Do you want this job or not? Hey, even the Tharg battle cruising was stopped to refuel. Curses, without me air horns, I cannot put the wind up him. And we'll very likely get another smack. Mega death to all phone clones. You're mine. This time, you're mine. Why ain't you got it yet, and when can I see it? Here we are. Got to keep your blood sugar up. It's tough out there. Tell me about it. I thought you were going to get it today. You're singing, you know, your leg. Needs another fitting. You know, there's only one reason why I can't walk perfectly normally. Yeah, what's that? I keep falling down. Well, you would, wouldn't you? It'll get better, you'll see. Yeah, give it time, it'll grow back, you reckon? It's good as, mate. You give it time and nobody will notice the difference. Wanna risk it? No. Hello, little boy. Is your mummy in? Chief. You on your own? Of course I am. Hey, why aren't you answering the phone? What is all this? Stay behind with this rent. Negative. You just can't handle visitors, you know what I'm saying? Where are you, Two Town? Well, you can't do St. Martin's Lane from Cannon Street, can you? So don't waste my time. Where's Bob? He went out. But he shouldn't be doing that. I've got and he's a long old guy, I know. Did Bob say how long he was going to be? Not long. That's what he said, anyway. You're never really sure with Bob, are you? Randall on the surface. She's on and as directed. Why? Nothing. Seymour, you call for the job, you take the job. So stop giving me a hard time. Billy, thank you. I'll take over. I've got a job for Warren and Page. Warren and Page, anybody? Thank you, Seymour. The, uh, the docket number is 1077-1077. Control to George, control to George. Come in, please, George. Hello, George, I've got a cash job for you. Um, you're to go to Camslang Travel, 317 Baker Street. Diana. 
and then take it to 94 Hall Place, off Horsebury Road, SW1. Uh, Diana. Yes. Bob says you're not allowed to give George cash jobs. Well, Bob's not here, is he? Aitchison and Grant, anybody? Do I have an Aitchison and Grant? Did you get your press? Didn't give him his new leg. Who's this then? The hospital? No, the limb fitting centre. He has to go twice a week. And you were supposed to get it today, were you? Supposed to go it last week. That right, Dave. What went wrong? Who knows? I mean, one week they tell me I'm not exercising enough, and now they're telling me I'm exercising too much. What can you do? Yeah, gets him down. How's a cup of tea then, Chief? No, I'm fine. Biscuit? No, thanks. Listen, I think you should know. A friend of yours turned up. A girl called Eve. She was asking after you. Control to one five. Control to one five. Have you delivered an SW1 yet? Over. George, are you receiving me? if his batteries have gone flat. He probably had an art attack and snuffed it. Hello there, my angel. Thought you'd gone home for the day. I've been running around for the Danish bank. And then I popped in to see Cindy. Diana? Yes, Angela? It's only a virus, but I don't think she'll be back. I think she wants something a bit quieter. Well, 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 look who's here. I suppose you've been to see Cindy, too. My, but you're beautiful when you're angry. We're sure to ride as me love, not sick visitors. Dave will be glad to hear that. You know we've lost George. Oh, aye. Like I know what tomorrow's weather will be in the winter of next year's Grand National. He's only been gone for a few minutes. Oh, so you've just mislaid him then. What was his last job? Uh, SW1 to Baker Street. Cash job. Well, there you go. Nonsense. He's probably just in a radio dead spot. That's what they call it, isn't it? George? George, I want you to call in if you can hear me. Is that clear? It's really important, George, so I want you to stop what you are doing right now and call in. Are you receiving me, George? The bingo's like a compulsion with him. He can't help it. So all the controllers try to keep him on account till payday. You weren't, you know. Wonderful. I think somebody might have told me. Bob. Like a word, please. Sure thing, Princess. In a minute, yeah. Stuck up. Please. Hey, you. Be likable. You're still on probation. Here. Cover the desk for me. Make sure Rato doesn't eat the dockets. You seen Dave recently? Not for a couple of days. Why? Do you know anything about this Eve girl? He's mentioned her. They've been out a few times, but I don't think it's anything serious. Of course, Dave might see it differently now. How do you mean? Well, it still might be very damaging if she reacts badly to the leg. Is there anything we can do? Well, but you couldn't be very much longer. Sure. I'll be with you in a sec. I'm trying to run a business here. I believe you. So? So you can do whatever you like in your lunch break, but don't bring it back to the office. Sorry, I don't follow. You know what I mean. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm talking about you and Angela. Me and Angel? Angel and me, are you serious? She was boasting about it early on. Are you going to tell me that's not where you've been? That's not where I've been. Don't give me any more rubbish about David and that wretched ambulance. Don't insult my intelligence. I wouldn't dream of it. Now, if you'll excuse me. Well, where were you then? What's the matter? Can't you think of a good enough lie to tell me? If it was any of your business, which it isn't, I went to tell Dave his girlfriend was looking for him. For two hours in the middle of the day? Angel, love, it seems I've wasted enough of the firm's time. Ha! Sorry, Diana. We don't all seem to share your keen sense of what makes the world go round. We'll have our talk tonight. Your place is planned, yeah? Yeah, fine. You are pathetic. 
That's me, boss. See you later, good buddy. Is he there? Yeah. No, who are you? Hey, just a minute. Hey, just a minute. Surprise! I say, darling, you can't go in there. But you thought you'd got rid of me. Look, I've got a couple of free passes for the hippodrome and I... You're nice and early. Oh, something smells good. Hmm, it's either obsession or spare ribs. Well, you haven't bothered to cook, have you? Can't you stay? Oh, no, it's not that. Just wondered if there's any for him. <laughs> oh, Ratso! Yeah, I couldn't leave me work. And Gina's allergic, so Billy couldn't take him. Oh, no, it's fine. Make yourselves comfortable. Look, there's some milk for Ratso. You said Dave was a bit down today. More than a bit, I think. Mm, his main problem's gonna be isolation. I won't be a second. Troop's been over to see him. But I think I should try and get to see him a little bit more. It's just that he's been building up a lot of anger. It only takes someone to say the wrong thing, the whole lot will come down on them. Have you any idea if Dave still thinks he's coming back? It's hard to tell. He doesn't give a lot, you know? Mm. Here we are, then. I hope that you both like Chinese food. Yeah, yeah, great. Fine. Why didn't you let me know? What would I have said? Here, Eve, have a guess why they're calling me Pogo Jackson these days. Leave me out. I just can't believe it. Hit and run accidents happen in the papers, not to people you know. Yeah, I was lying. It wasn't an accident. It was mice. Oh, stop it! For God's sake, give me a break! I'm trying to... What? Help? Is that it? You want to help? Well, go away, then. Leave me alone. It's not my fault. Go on, push off. Angel, that meal was magic. More coffee? No, I'd better push off. You're on night duty, aren't you? I'm not tonight. I swapped with one of the others. Yeah. You know, you made a really nice job of this flat. <laughs> oh, sorry. It's important to have your own place. Price is high. That's London for you. I mean, working all the hours God sends. Never having time to enjoy yourself. I'm enjoying myself now. Yeah, but independence isn't everything. I mean, here's you working yourself to death. And when do you get time to enjoy it? Diana's the same. That's her philosophy. Work, work, work. Personally, I can't see the point. See? Still got all the old magic? You're impressed, aren't you? It's late. Why didn't you go home? Well, I know it's late, but I found this little restaurant and I said to the waiter, have you got frog's legs? And he said, yeah. So, I said, well, up over there and get us a pizza. Oh, Eve, babes. What am I going to do with a... No. Well, now that I've bought it, we could start buying you some pizza.
Street Wise is back and next Been week. Been around the world. Stuff. Right, I think we've got a hit here, Lisa. Could you just put a bit more bass? I've been around, around the world. world. Yeah, not too much bass. <laughs> Been around the world. If you'd like to win a 12-inch single of All Around the World, then we, here's, we have a question, don't we? Been yeah, the question the is, which band was I in before this? Cold Cut. And it isn't Cold Cut. It, it isn't, isn't Cold Cut, no. All right, so send your uh, answers to this address, PO Box 55. Birmingham, B1, B1 2DA. What's on yes, tomorrow, Scully? Tomorrow we've got uh, the Sooty Show and uh, we've got the Wizard of Oz, which is very, very good. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know it was radio control, did you? <laughs> That's oh, you're still well in. I know. Lisa, thanks ever so much for coming along and being Thank our guest you. today. Yes, indeed. Uh, looks like number one next week, doesn't it? Ooh. Fingers crossed. Definitely, I think. Right, so I think we've got the winning mix here. we just work on the job. Been around See the world. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.